Hey language learners, welcome to Learn English, your go-to destination for learning English through text with Arabic translations. If you're excited about improving your English skills, don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell icon for regular updates. Give this video a thumbs up if you're ready to embark on a language journey and share it with anyone who might find it beneficial. Now, let's delve into our immersive English learning experience with Arabic translations. Let's get started. Shadows of Deception In the bustling city of Metropolia, a professional conman named Adrian Locke mastered the art of deception, seamlessly transitioning from one elaborate persona to another. His journey began as a strict general in the public finance investigation, where he exploited the system's loopholes for personal gain. A trail of financial misdeeds marked his rise, and as authorities closed in, he vanished into the shadows. Adrian re-emerged as a wealthy businessman, establishing an empire of illegitimate enterprises. The intricacy of his schemes eluded even the sharpest investigators. Driven by ambition, he then assumed the guise of a renowned doctor practicing medicine. His silver tongue and fabricated credentials allowed him to infiltrate the highest echelons of the medical community, leaving a wake of unsuspecting victims. However, fate took an unexpected turn when Adrian posed as an ambassador in the Ministry of Foreign Affairs. As he played his diplomatic role with finesse, he caught the attention of Officer Daniel Harris, a seasoned investigator who had dedicated his life to chasing down elusive criminals. Harris, fueled by a sense of justice, pursued Adrian relentlessly, navigating through a web of deceit that spanned continents. The chase intensified, each confrontation a high-stakes game of wits. Despite numerous close calls, Adrian always managed to slip away, leaving Harris frustrated but more determined than ever. The cat-and-mouse game continued for years until an unexpected twist altered the course of their destinies. A series of humanitarian issues surfaced, casting a light on the lives of both the fraudster and the officer. Adrian, once driven solely by greed, found himself entangled in circumstances that made him question his choices. As Officer Harris delved deeper into the con man's past, he uncovered a complex web of motivations and personal struggles that humanized his adversary. The lines between right and wrong blurred as the two men found themselves at the intersection of justice and compassion. The once clear-cut roles of pursuer and pursued became muddled and an unlikely alliance formed in the face of a common enemy, a corrupt system that had allowed Adrian's schemes to flourish. In a surprising turn of events, the con man and the officer joined forces to expose the systemic flaws that enabled individuals like Adrian to thrive. As their collaboration unfolded, they became catalysts for change, working together to bring about reforms in law enforcement and financial systems. The story concludes with Adrian facing the consequences of his actions, but not in the way one might expect the once relentless Officer Harris, having discovered the shades of grey in the pursuit of justice, advocates for a more compassionate approach, recognising that sometimes redemption lies in addressing the root causes of criminal behaviour. In the end, the tale of the con man and the officer becomes a narrative of redemption highlighting the transformative power of empathy and understanding in the pursuit of a better, more just society. Hello everyone, if you enjoyed this video and want to see more content like this, don't forget to hit that subscribe button 
and turn on notifications. Your support means a lot to me. Also, if you found value in this, give it a thumbs up and consider sharing it with your friends. Let's grow this community together. Thanks for watching and being part of Learn English.